All right, what's up, everybody? We're back, and we're into the second video. I take, I ain't gonna lie, I, sl I took a couple of snippets at the comments, so apparently the rumors is true. We are getting Homelander, Omni-Man, and Peacemaker. Honestly, that's crazy, because NetherRealm Studios has enough guest characters from the last four games to make it its own game. Like, it's literally just a game made of IPs. We're talking... Like, literally, with Jason, Freddy, uh, 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 Predator, Alien, uh, Leatherface, I'm missing one, uh, there's, there's one I'm specifically missing, I don't, I can't remember the name, but I can't think of it right now, um, Robocop, Rambo, uh, Terminator, and then we got the three in this game, that's literally, like, 16 characters already, I think. Or unless I can't count. I think that's 16 characters. No, it's like, it's, it's like 11? 11 characters? It's a lot of characters, right? But, yo, even even like, even like in a comic book one, Spawn, TMNT, uh, Hellboy, like, dog, that's crazy. That's a lot of characters. I really, if NetherRealm made a game, I think... NetherRealm should make a game, and I know it's, it would be expensive. Uh, expensive as in trying to get the licensing, I think. Um, making an, uh, an, uh, uh, a game where there's literally nothing but IPs of the, of the guest characters they had. Dude, that'd be crazy. And have the flagship character, have the flagship character be Sweet Tooth from Twisted Metal. That'd be crazy. That'd be really crazy. It's a pipe dream. But I, dude, I wish. Anyways, let's uh, let's get into it because I'm. I, you see all the stuff on the side. I'm very curious, and I don't want. I don't want to get be spoiled on like what the game actually is gonna look like. And I know it's in 1440. That's because OBS has issues running it. Okay, so let's see what they brought us today. A battle between good and this evil is, is a roster review. <laughs> They actually put Omni Man, yo! Damn, he look good! Like, they actually. Who is that? Yo! Holy, they got Peacemaker! John Cena is in the game, dog! Oh, that's, um. I know who that is. That's, uh, what's his face? Oh my gosh, he was in Deception, but I can't remember him. I hate that dude. Who is that? Oh, it's Takeda. We get Homelander versus Omni Man, dog. So they're in the base roster? Dude. If this is the base roster, that's crazy, dog. I still don't know who it is. Is this Ermac? That better not be Ermac. That's it? No wonder you told me to pay it to both in one video. <laughs> Dog, why do they look so clean? They got a Viltramite. Peace, man. I'm not going to lie. Takeda, this fucker. Is this Ermac? Who is this guy? Nah. This, bro, I'm going to be honest. If if you were to show somebody a screenshot of all the DLC characters in this similar like format, how there's one person above and you got the other. If you were to show somebody, like this is going to be the most brutal MK to have. I thought like, I, I thought the previous not MK, I thought MKX was brutal. Dog. Omni-Man and Homelander in the same fighting game. That's beyond a pipe dream. That's like, that's what, what do they, what do you call those? That's those, um, death, that's a death battle dream, right? It's like, oh, it's something that only happens in death battle and now it's here. It's actually here. Listen, hear me out. Capcom, Capcom, if you're, I don't know why Capcom would be listening to this, but Capcom, if you're listening, Platinum Game, if you're listening, we need you to donate Dante, 
Virgil, and Nero, and Killer Instinct. Platinum, we need you to donate Bayonetta, Akira Howard from Astro Chain, doesn't matter which gen, uh, which which sibling, brother or sister, and 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 the wonderful 101. I don't know how that's gonna work. Put them in there. Who cares? Bayonetta definitely needs to be in Killer Instinct. We need, listen, listen. This happening is crazy. If you sold somebody this years ago, they would think you're 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 lying. They wouldn't believe you. Matter of fact, they might even try to get you arrested. This is crazy. And we still didn't get Freddy and Jason in the same game. We have Freddy and Nine, and we got Jason and Tim. Dog. Mortal Kombat 1. Hey, listen, if there's a story mode, Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat 1 is literally up here with Street Fighter 6. Literally. There, there is no, there is no comparison. You can, listen, if we get an Injustice 3, I need you to put Homelander in Injustice 3. We need Superman to whoop his ass. I, I hate to say, because you don't want repetitive, you don't want repetitive, you know, uh, repetitive DLC. But the fact that, dog, we need Superman as DLC. Matter of fact, we don't even need him in, we don't even need these three in, in Injustice 3. Make Superman DLC just to fight Homelander. Please, please, I'm begging. I am begging you. This would literally be, I, I have not played MKX. I still think it would be my favorite, but this possibly, like, dog. I need to see, now I'm probably not gonna play as Home, Omni Man or Homelander. I'm, 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 I'm probably gonna pick up uh, Peacemaker, to be honest with you. I prefer more grounded characters, more, you know, actual combat style, but, This is crazy. I, I literally don't know don't, don't know what else to say. This is crazy. But are these DLC characters? It says oh combat combat pack roster. Well, they're not uh they're not in the base game, so uh that's crazy. But like the con the DLC is already announced. Dog. Why is it on the switch? Oh, it says it right. It is Ermac. Quan Chi, that was his name. It is Ermac. Yo, Ermac. Why are you so ugly, dog? Has he always looked like this? I'm going to have to play Ermac because Ermac was my favorite. Just like by design, always was my favorite. That's crazy. Okay, so what? Premium Edition, Combat Pack, Early Access to Combat 1, Jean-Claude Van Damme skin for Johnny Cage, five new cameo characters. We already know who they are. And one week early access to DLC characters. Wow. And receive Shang Tsung and access to the closed beta. It's on PlayStation. Oh, it's only on PlayStation and Xbox Series S. Damn. Check in with your local retailer. Don't pre order. That sucks because, like, everything else is worth it. I just wish. Dog. Yo. Is this shit on Steam? Hold on. Let's check Steam, guys. Let's check Steam. Because I want to know. I'm gonna let I'm gonna let you know when I find out because I want to know. Yeah. Where did you go? Can I? I can't click Steam. Wait. That's weird. I can't move Steam. It's stuck. Okay. Anyways. Uh, okay. So Mortal Kombat One. It's seventy bucks. Pre-order now to get playable Shang Tsung. Okay, 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 okay. When is it released? September 19th? I got time. It's two weeks. It's only two. Okay. Damn! The premium edition is 109? But you automatically get the DLC characters and you get, you know, early access. Otherwise, everything else would cost. Why? What? Let's let's go here. Let's go here, right? Let's look. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, there's three collectors edition. What does this include? 
base game, okay, yeah, 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 uh, same thing. 2,700 2, 2, damn dragon crystals. Liu Kang sculpture designed by Koar, Koars with signature glow in the dark details and 16.5 inches tall. Koars are imprints inspired by Mortal Kombat 1, exclusive steel case, exclusive limited edition Liu Kang in game color variant inspired by the cool the Koars figure. How much is this? I'm just curious. It's probably gonna be like three hundred, right? Oh wow, I didn't we didn't load it up. You can only get the collector's edition. What? Hold on. That's dumb. Yo, the collector's edition is only I don't even have a PS5. I'm not finna buy the game twice. That's crazy. I don't, I like it. I don't like it that much. I like it enough to buy the collector's edition. I don't like it enough to buy. Let's just see. Let's see how much it is. Right? How much are we looking at? Oh! oh! That literally that's another fight stick. Honestly, that's the price of an, of another fight stick. Can we see the? Oh, then you got the picture of the figures. Oh, here's the picture of the figure. So that's the costume skin you'd also get too. It'll be like that. It'll be like that. Damn! If it was for, for PC dog, I would have got it. I would have got it. That's crazy. Well, it seems nice. You know, I guess we'll just go with the. Uh, I don't even. I don't even know if it's worth getting a premium edition because like. Yeah, you get the con the first combat pack. I don't know. I see. I did it for Street Fighter. I might as well do it for this. So I actually plan on. I really like. <clears throat> for me to play a fighting game, like for me to actually want to learn it, I have to want to learn a character, and it has to. Typically, is only one. It only has to be one. But like, being more than one is actually like signet solidifies me wanting to play the game. So I know I'm not used to dialing combos, and but I will definitely try my best to actually learn uh, Mortal Kombat 1 because not not only does the DLC roster look fire as hell, but Lee May, Johnny Cage, oh my gosh, I can't wait. So y'all take it easy on me if you ever see me in the game, you know what I'm saying? But dog, I'm hyped. I'm, I'm pre-ordering it, so I'm sold, so. You did your thing, Nether Realm. You made Lee May a boss. You made Tanya a boss. You made everybody a boss. Oh man, I can't wait. I can't wait. So I, I'm not gonna be able to play the club later. But with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. I hope you guys have fun. Till next time. Peace out.